Hi friends, so in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a cover within a few minutes. So when you open the create page you should see an empty template like here. Then next you want to open the sizing panel and then select your planner size. Next you want to open the layout panel and then select a layout. So for the cover layout we will select the lower right cover here and then the first one like this. Also apply this layout to the right page by selecting the right page and then click on it like this. Next let's apply a pattern by clicking on the styling panel and you see that you have the colors up here and the patterns down here. So we recently just added um, over 20 new patterns. So let's select one and also click on full to apply to the full page. Um, for example select this one here a celestial one which is my favorite right now and then you can also further change the colors up here for example make it black then when you're happy with the pattern you can now move on to the widget so click on the widget and go to graphics and then down here you have the geometry then you can select a round widget a square or a rectangle so let's click for example on the circular one and then up here uh, you can type in a name or a text I'll call it cover one and then the right side I'll make a second cover a square one and I'll call it cover two like this let's increase and change the font so go to the text panel here and then let's select a different font for example this one here and the font or the cover text looks too small right now so let's click on it and increase the size by scrolling down here and increase it on the slider like this you can also adjust the font weight and make it lighter and let's do the same on the left side so click on it and then on the right side let's increase the font size and lower the font weight like this now if you're happy with how the cover looks like you can print it out and it will print out two covers at a time, time for you so here you see that the margins on the right side and on the left side are exactly the same which means you can punch the holes on the left side or on the right side so you can just move on and export the planner and click on generating pdf then click on download and here you go so from here on you would just print out the first cover and the back page would be a blank page so just print this cover on the front page and then cut it and you will have two covers now if you want to have a pattern on the back page as well without those widgets here we could go back and then click on workspace and then here you can add two pages and the first page would look like this like we have it now and the second page we would only want to have a pattern so to do that um, select the widget here so click on it and down here under misc we should have an empty widget this one here so click and it will apply an empty widget and remove it for you the same here click on it and apply an empty widget and there you go so page one looks like this and page two should look like this then if you click on batch generate pdf it should export you the planner with uh, two pages and the page one should look like this and the back page should be empty with the patterns only so next let me quickly show you how you can create um, and apply the creepy cute and alien patterns we just added today so let's go back to page one 
And now um, let's just change the background here by clicking on styling and then open the pattern panel and down here you have all the alien patterns. So right now it's overlapping so first let's click here on none to remove the patterns in the background and now we can apply all the creepy cute and alien patterns. If you want you can also apply a background for example if you click here um, it will apply you a background a color background and let's quickly open the quick menu and here you can also change the color for example maybe make it a light purple blue what you can do as well is you can also for example if you selected this pattern here, you can also lower the opacity of the widget so you'll have a shine through effect if you like that. For example, like this. So if you like this cover, then again click on Batch Generate. So first I think we should remove this one. So click on Remove it and then Add, pad add Planner. And again, we, want, we don't want to have this widget, so click on the widget and remove it by applying an empty widget like this. Okay, so here you go. So this is page one, page two. Let's click on Batch Generate PDF. And here you go, click on download. Okay, so if you have any questions, feel free to message us on Instagram or Facebook anytime and we will try to respond to your questions as quickly as we can. Bye!